Hey, thanks for stopping by. My name is Tyler and today we're going to do some more work with Terraform. Today I'm going to show you how to set up a VPC using Terraform in the AWS public cloud. So before we start that, start that, what is a VPC? A VPC is a little slice of whichever public cloud provider you're using, just a little space where you can set up your own infrastructure and have a private cloud-like experience. So Without further ado, I'm gonna flip it over to my laptop and we'll walk through it. All right, so here we are in our Cloud9 IDE. It is my preferred IDE. I just believe it's the easiest to use. And so that's what we're going with. So in our main.tf file here, we're only gonna need a few lines of code to deploy this VPC. The first one is going to be resource, and then we're gonna say AWS underscore VPC, and then we're going to give our VPC a name in the Terraform configuration file. This is not the same name it will be given in AWS when you look at it from the console, but it's what you use to reference it in other configuration blocks in your Terraform files. So let's name it Terraform VPC 1. And then we're gonna give it a curly bracket. And then the only argument you need here, or attribute, I think it's called, is going to be cider block equals. And this is the range of IP addresses that we're going to designate our VPC to use. So we're gonna give it a whole bunch with a 10.0.0.0 forward slash 16 address. And then just for fun, and we can also add tags. So if you press enter a couple times, you can say tags equals curly bracket, enter name equals Terraform. Wow, typing is hard guys. Terraform VPC. And then when we look at it in the console, it will just make it a little bit easier to locate this guy. So we're gonna save those changes and go ahead and do a Terraform initiate. Give it a second here. There we go. Up next, we're gonna give it a Terraform plan. Give it a second to plan itself out. Boom, looks like right here, you can see our CIDR block has been defined and our VPC will be created. So now we can say Terraform apply. Wow, what did I do there? Okay, wow, I broke some there. Like I said, we're gonna do Terraform apply. We'll give it a second. We're gonna say yes. Boom, looks like that worked just fine. So now we're gonna go over to our console and we're going to go find our VPC that we just created. Make sure that it got made. And then, should be tagged here. There we go, cool. So you can see our VPC was created with our 10.0.0.0 slash 16 address block. And you can see our tags right down here. Ooh, it's a little bit bright. There we go. See our tags right down here with our Terraform VPC name. And yeah, it's as easy as that. That is how you create a VPC with Terraform. I appreciate you guys watching. Have a great rest of your day.